This is serious. This is a girl named Kylie Rodney. She was most likely murdered by somebody close to her or somebody's. Yep. And it's just so sad because he has just used this as a way for him to gain views and shit. Like, really, dude? Have some morals, please. Show well, the person I you pretended to be. Keep pretending. Believe, I genuinely believe he started this with good intentions. I do too. We've got Megan the mom with us. Hello, Megan the mom. You just, you just, we, I just read your comment, didn't I? Welcome. Yeah. Hi. How hey. are you guys? Welcome. You're, you're Welcome day. He, you said he's making a mockery of true crime. What's your thoughts on Ryan? I honestly feel like we all need to just stop. Right. Yeah. But we have to respond and take up for our Tony and ourselves yeah. and the victims. Yeah. Well, I believe can't just be reason. quiet. Because they and don't want to freak out. Well, I, I, yeah, because I'll, I'll say I'll say right now, I've, I've been receiving death threats. I've been getting all kinds yeah. of harassment on my Facebook, no, Instagram. Wow. Yeah, I just Crazy. block and delete, report them, block and delete, no, I couldn't report them. You know? like <laughs> yeah, no, I totally get that you need to like defend yourself, but it's like. Yeah. Please. The Logan Paul situation, guys. The Logan Paul situation. He had yes men all around him, right? Yep. And look yep. what yes. happened. He ended up recording yeah. a dead body out in Japan. Yep. And he, he said, I had yes men all around me. They were all friends, people that were like yep. enamored by me, basically fans that he picked up and helped to grow yep. their own like following people he'd yeah. help so they weren't about yeah. to say nothing to him because yeah. he bought them cars and all that crap let's, let's, same let's, thing with Ryan. Let, let's grab a yeah, quick phone call go, uh, go ahead caller what's right, your, uh, hey ahead, tony how you doing buddy hey i'm doing okay what's what's on your mind doing good thank hey, you so, you know i like your channel i've been checking you out for a little while appreciate it thank so, you you know the messages you know shit happens it ain't a big thing mm -hmm. my question is in the video mm -hmm. i don't know what you guys are talking about but you said i like Pedophilia, I mean necrophilia. He clipped mm -hmm. that out of a different that? live. Uh, yeah, I've already we've already talked about that uh, multiple times. It was just a prank call that I was just using sarcasm. Uh, you watch How about you go to All American <laughs> Dream Chasers and you watch his whole yeah. video? It's like dirty comedy. Watch yeah, watch the video in its entirety. Uh, it was yeah, exactly. but, you know sometimes like you know when you say stuff like that, it's uh it, it's it, you know me, right. I don't, it's not in my conscience, so I don't say it. I, if yeah, you I go around, around the house, house. Yeah, yeah, but you got to understand what I'm, I'm trying to tell you is that it was a phone call. Yes. Out yes. Yeah, on up. purpose. Yes, and I make up. him look evil. Every yeah. Well, I mean, uh, yeah, it's just the guy hung up. Uh, yeah, he just, uh, you know, he. It was a prank call. The guy was saying some yep. stuff about that on the mm -hmm. on the prank call, and I just I rode with it, and I just right. you know, like I said once again, it's sarcasm. Well, it was look just at sarcasm. the comedy barn. People have they don't understand. Yeah, I just well, yeah, that's takes, all it was. It's just like I was just rolling with it. Like yeah, I mean, every YouTuber. Do you guys honestly believe I'm doing stuff him. like that? I mean, come on. It's like <laughs> no, uh, we look. wouldn't be here if we did. Yeah, they don't yeah, understand. Yeah, exactly. Sarcasm. You guys are smart. You know, you ladies are smart. You wouldn't be here. You wouldn't be broadcasting. Well, I wouldn't be here. Yeah, yeah, that's true. If I if I was doing it, I personally wouldn't be here. Yeah, we wouldn't be here. Like like that. You know what I'm saying? It's, like, it's up. freaking that's, sarcasm. Oh, what, yeah. what he does, they don't understand. It's just that world we live in. He, you know, they're getting oh, yeah. Some, they're someone, getting someone wrote on the chat, this group on the panel has got Tony's back. Ain't nobody folding. It's not that nobody's folding. No. If he were wrong, I would tell him you're wrong. I, I asked I am on messages. Like I said, messages. Fan. Look, guys. Yeah. I verified this. This is just a spam message. And the the, yeah. the like the reaction, people were like, oh, what about his reaction? You didn't freak out till he started cussing you out. And then you started yeah. cussing back. Like, dude, yeah. you like remain calm and you done your uh, commentator step repeating you know, words. I mean, yeah. Ryan I, Jones. I, 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 mean, I got a little heated. When, when he started putting the phone up to the camera and demanding that I answer him, I got a little heated. Who wouldn't I got a little hot under You're the a man. You're a yeah, man. Of course yeah. you're going. You're a grown man. You're not one yeah. of these trolls yeah, like him. I just him. wanted to backhand him. You know, like, Psycho Bell was a cool guy. I like Psycho He Bell. is. Yeah. I brought him on my panel, and then Zav had him on. Yeah. And well, I knew that wouldn't go well. I don't. I don't know. What, I, I told I him, him I, 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 when I was on his show. I told him, uh, the, the, you know, because he, he asked me if I if I could invite him to the to the gangbang. I said, yeah, for next next oh gangbang for sure, I'm going to invite him. <laughs> he, he, he got, yeah, he's psycho babble. Yeah, well, he's the thing with psycho babble, and I don't yeah. know if I'm the only one. Okay, when yeah. I found him, he was genuinely concerned about up church. He didn't want him yeah. to get food. He was you on know, his and, side at first. I, did yeah, you know, I, was I don't know when you all found him, but I found him and put him on my panel. Then he, everybody else started having him on. And I I don't know, like with Tiff. Tiff is a good friend of mine. I love her to death. Um, he's I've been friends with her since I was a creator back a year and a half ago. 
And um, I was really worried when I seen that he was on there because I knew that he, you know, where she has Ryan on, I knew that he would say something. Yeah, go ahead, caller. Uh, yeah, man, I was just listening to what y'all were saying, talking about the what the guy just said about the pedophilia or necrophilia. Uh-huh. Now, I'm not trying to discriminate you, Tony, but a lot of people are probably thinking like everybody on this channel has no idea what. Tony may or may not do when he signs off. That's why you have to do your due diligence. And yeah. if you don't stand up for yourself, they're like, well, he's guilty. You're hiding he ain't something. saying nothing. He's yeah. hiding it. Then we're we're talking his army, it. apparently. You're, You're wanting attention. Yeah, well, I appreciate You're you guys about being my soldiers. Crazy. Thank you. I yeah. got some <laughs> tough ladies on my, on my army. Where here. were all of you <laughs> on September 6th? On September the 6th? I'll have to check my TikTok. But most likely I was getting my child out of school. I'm sure. Swingers party, were, it was wild yeah. as hell. Yeah, Brittany and I took Tony with me. Bang, uh, yeah, with, uh, I took Tony with me. Yeah, yeah we're I'm at flying the, over there. All of us were at the gangbang. Mark, weren't you, at, you were at the gangbang with us too, right, Mark? We got another yeah, schedule, Mark, there. if you'd like to yeah, come see, to the Mark next one. Yeah, see, Mark was there one. with us. We were all gangbanging that night. Heck yeah, yeah. dude. I'm, it was great. Yeah, I, I would love I to come back. I think my private jet just for that. We've been locked up from COVID. You know, we went going out. Been banging our heads on the wall. That's the only gangbang we've been having. That was on my bucket list. As soon as COVID's over, I'm going to go gangbang. Hey, what? Watch out, they're going to clip this. Oh, well, we're joking. Oh, no, they're going to clip this. Oh, yeah, we're definitely in the next video. Oh, yeah. yeah. At least we're we're creating content for somebody. Yeah, Yeah. our own content. That's right. I'm telling you, we're going to have a reaction video. Come on, the wire. He'll have some. He'll have some content now for his channel. Look at us, early birds. We're up here, living life. Well, here it's almost 10 o'clock in the morning. It's now. Same here. Tell me, what time zone are you in? I don't even what know how to answer that. Don't even answer that. Don't even answer that. Don't even answer that. I'm on the that. Twilight Zone. <laughs> the Twilight Zone. Same zone. <laughs> not to be rude or disrespectful, it's but same, I would not same, uh, same time zone as, uh, uh, what's his name? Ryan Upchurch. He's on the Twilight Zone. <laughs> all right. No, I just didn't know how long that you've zone. been streaming. So, see, mm-hmm. we're all on the other side of the United States. And, like, yeah. his trolls were saying I'm, because I'm I'd seen him on. And we were talking about, like, when I go there. They were like, oh, she's involved. I'm like, dude, I am all the way across the friggin' United States. I, my daughter what started the school that time. Be? Like, I don't know that. But but if you have anything they can clip, they're going to make you out to be yeah. the next bit, the person. Yeah. Well, see, that's why I just roll with it, you know, because it doesn't matter what you're going to do. You, you no, can't, it don't. You're never going to win. No. So just yeah, we are going to win. We are going to win, Tony. Yeah, well, no. we, yeah, well, yeah exactly. Yeah, we are. We're going to fight this for Kylie, and we're going to stop this bullying. Some of these people are scarier than what they claim you to be, yeah. or the other yeah, people. Exactly, scary. exactly. Throw, like but, throwing rocks in a glass house, right? Come on. He's yeah, a he's sweetheart. Hard. I could tell. I'm so sorry. Tony is sweet and he's funny yeah. and he cares about society. He talks about you know the world and what's going on. Like he cares about shit. Yeah. No, I mean it's just when shady stuff happens. I mean, like I said, I think. Like I said, I think the Ickmail thing, I don't know, but that seems He's in staged. Florida. Yeah. No, but the call seems staged. I don't think well, anything. Ronnie, Ronnie, I don't know. Ronnie, that thing is weird. So. I don't know if he's a real person, if he was at the party, if he has cousins, or if he was paid off by Ickmail. I don't know. But Ickmail lives in Florida. And that is exactly why Ryan had met Myro, pretending to be Ronnie. You could see that that picture, his knee was black, his hand was black, in the thing on Naked Mill stuff. And it, mm-hmm. it's just, like, wrong for him to go and do what he did. Oh, I know lighting. I don't think he's as great with things as he says. I think he's just got people that does it for him. And, and he yeah. don't want to admit that. Well, like I said, I mean, I think what it happened was that looked shady. Then the Xanime girl. I mean, the Xanime girl looked shady to me well, I mean, of course she did he also clipped all that out of context i mean you well, know no, would, she was I a little odd you. but you gotta remember she's not from our country she yeah. don't and fully understand english sometimes i've had to explain things to her not that she's I, dumb because she's super smart she works I'm for NASA. Say, she several she languages works for NASA. I don't well you know what it's like to be a fan of a creator mm-hmm. and have their back and take up for them that's what she was doing because she was really taking it for Ikid Mel, not Ronnie. Yeah. But Ronnie was on his page, and that was bringing Ikid Mel trouble. So yeah. she spoke up for him. And then it looked really bad, and Ryan didn't like that because she said something he didn't like. The house. Granny's watching. Oh, Can yes. you hear us? Go ahead. Granny's watching. Hey, Brett. Hey, Tony. Hey, I just have um, a few questions. 
Go ahead. Have you addressed what your ex moderators are claiming against you? Uh, no, no. I, I said uh, let them prove it. What is okay. that that they're claiming, Jess? I have not yeah. heard anything like that. Uh, no, he did. Uh, he Inappropriate. Did the video. Well, yeah, I think I, I think I went over it with Dusty and uh, Fetters. She's right. talking about something totally different, Tony. She's yeah. talking about something totally different. What is it, Jess? Didn't... Yeah, what is it? Yeah, what's going on? A few you of your ex came up on a, a different channel and they said that you've been very inappropriate towards them pushy um like think of the yeah. think of like you know the ryan situation though are they trying to get him like to talk to it, them yeah, and get their like attention inappropriate in what way Why sexually if they were telling his mind what is i said sexually aggressive with them is what they're claiming sexually aggressive yeah how was that what the hell did i do <laughs> I, uh, I think that this is all I, like the more a big false accusation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Like, yeah, I got uh, how many of my moderators? Uh, maybe a, a lucky lady was on. I mean, we could ask her. A lucky lady, maybe we we'll get you back in here. See, the thing uh, of it ask, is, ask, ask my moderator. Being on Ryan, put it, put, being it in on the, I'll have com put in the comments, uh, moderators. Have I, have I been sexually about, aggressive to yeah. any of my moderators? It's uh, popular to be on Ryan's side of this, and well, these people the are going to say no, shit. No, live stream, and you know, back ball, it might help clear you. I'm not trying to attack you. Well, I don't need to. I don't need to clear myself. I haven't done anything. I'm. I don't need to clear myself. Well, and, you know, like I always say, I don't need to. I don't need to answer to you. I don't need to answer to anybody. But uh, I haven't done well, any. True, I haven't you're done a public wrong. speaker on a public platform, and yeah, you're tagging. Yeah and, a, and, yeah, and that's the problem. I'm a public figure that's being accused of something that's uh, false. But I do think that you put out a lot of inappropriate behavior while using well, Kylie in the title. Yeah. For I example, 9-11. Yeah, I've been, been a, a kind of sorry. sarcastic, but who are you to judge what's inappropriate? I don't, I don't understand. Like, what's, well, I mean, in your opinion, what, what's inappropriate in your opinion? Well, that's what people judge. We judge inappropriate. Inappropriate, well, yeah. in my I opinion. Mean, everybody's judging me. Yeah. So I mean, yeah. So what's so what exactly is inappropriate? Well, tagging a nine eleven video and then proceeding to call people off of um, Craigslist with sexual manners and the, the calling of businesses and prank calls and everything and oh, yeah. And, you know, you yeah. say you're all American trucker or American dream chaser, then oh, you know okay. how hard these business oh, workers. So you're, have so you're one of those little sensitive ones. Are you're a snowflake? It, it hurts your feelings. Yeah, you, you, don't see, you, don't see any, you don't see any humor in any of that? No, I, mean, I don't see any humor in a bunch of grown adults calling businesses that well, are busy. I mean, like like an like an I mean, I'm sorry that you don't see the humor in it, but everybody on my show, how many people enjoy the prank calls that we, I, I got a whole bunch of people that enjoy the prank calls. Prank calls. Do you really think that, that, that we're actually picking up hookers and whatever? I mean, what do you think we're doing? I mean, are you that naive? I mean, Respectful how, how, business women, how, 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 how much education do you have? I mean, have you have you graduated high school? What? Did, why do you go to personal insults? I'm That's part of the question. problem. You're, you're judging me. I want to ask you the questions. Am I judging you personally, or yes, am I you judging you? Just got to say what I do is inappropriate. It is inappropriate. Well, I you're think you're inappropriate. Family. I think you're inappropriate for answering, asking me these questions when you know it's a joke. But I, why do you always go to personal insults, well, Tony? Can we yes, have an adult question, conversation? I'm telling you that it's a joke. It's, a, it's just we were just joking around, and you're okay, trying to make a, you're you're trying to make you know, a mountain out of a molehill. There's nothing that's, there. That's not you making a mountain out of a molehill. Uh, it is asking you questions as to why you can't understand why people have a problem. All right, goodbye. I, I'm not. I'm not. I just refuse to argue about this. I, it is what it is. You guys know it's a joke. We, we joked around a little bit. Oh, now you can't joke around. It's offensive. Everybody's offended. I, oh, geez. Come on. I mean, oh, I'm not offended. I, I just. They're, they're driving down the road listening to, listening, uh, to Tupac and, uh, I don't know, 50 Cent and everything else, Every where they're dropping yeah. every F bomb. And I'm way too scared to ever be on any kind of panel with him, man. Everybody who does gets ripped to shreds. Like, right. And of like course, I said, not, not necessarily by about. him, just by his people. Like, 
Right. Like I get what people are saying. It's not funny to talk about those things, but you got to understand the way it was taken out of the context. Like the mm-hmm. way the call was at the time, yeah. it was a weird call. I watched it and I just <laughs> felt like Tony was responding and he said the wrong thing. Like, and then he, you got to understand the way it was taken out of the context. Like the mm-hmm. way the call was at the time, yeah. it was a weird call. I watched it and I just <laughs> felt like Tony was responding and he said the wrong thing. Like, and then he, like, even he didn't mean any of it. You could tell. Yeah. And I understand. Time. Yeah. It was a weird call. I watched it and I just <laughs> felt like Tony was responding and he said the wrong thing. Like, and then he, like, even he didn't mean any of it. You could tell. Yeah. And I understand people are like, well, why would you ever say something like that? But people say things, people were, we're only human. And I mean, go back and look. I guarantee I could go take some things out of context that Ryan has put out. But, but we don't do that because we're not that damn shady and we ain't got all that time. We got shit to do in our lives rather than to troll and hurt other people and make them look guilty of something. I mean, I'm a sinner. I've 100%. Yeah. I've never said nothing like that. I mean, because like I said, that's just not my thing. No, yeah, it's it. his thing Horrible, yeah, like, horrible joke. Uh, Lindsay's in the comment. Lindsay says, I do like the prank calls, though. Yeah, saying that. You, go, go to Ryan Upchurch. He'll tell you what you want to hear. <laughs> 